welcome back to the episode of uh, of um what was it called again? <laughs> uh, of Stardew Valley. And I'm just gonna water my plants here a little bit. Um, I've been going through this a couple of days now and have been trying to figure out exactly what the purpose is of most of the things there. So I've, I think I've, I've gotten down, I've gotten it down to a bit of a, oh shit, no more water. Yeah, I think I've got it down to, um, to, to a T. I think I, I understand now what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm supposed to be watching all these plants, obviously, otherwise they die. <laughs> But I have to make money. So the purpose of this game is just to make money. And with that money, you are supposed to uh, buy new things, I guess. Well, the street suddenly just grew up here. Wow. How did that happen? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I got some potatoes, two potatoes, from my Mr. What, what, I have, I have an, an email. Let me just read that. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventure spirit that much I can tell. If you can slay 10 slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventures guild. Be careful. 10 slimes? Okay, deeper in the mine, reach level 40. In the level 40? <laughs> I don't know. Zero out of 10 slimes slain. And I've already met 18 people. Um, I don't want to raise any animals yet. I have still have the rat problem and the foraging ahead. I, I didn't craft it yet. Deeper in the mines, yeah, all, all this good stuff. But I have been able to make some money, which is great, even though my potatoes aren't ready yet. Now, I also got these rice shoots, and I'm not entirely sure what to do. It says plant near a body of water. So I'm, I'm just going to go and plant them. I also have a quartz, and I got 10 slimes, and I have an earth crystal. I don't know what these are. And I'm not sure exactly what to do with them, so <laughs> I'm just gonna go and sell. I'm gonna sell this or bring it to the um, what do you call him again? The the, the guy that that does the he, he's an archaeologist, I think. Yeah, he's an archaeologist, and he does all that stuff. So anyway, let's go and check out if we can sell some of these stones. I can, I can imagine the earth crystal might be worth something. And potentially, the quartz might be worth something towards the, to the museum. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I'm not quite sure exactly if it, if anything actually um, closed on Wednesday. Ah, oh, it's Wednesday again. Nothing is posted today. Well, that's kind of sad. Oh, we got another person over here. Let's go talk to him. See if he is new. Hello. Looks like a good day to play catch, huh? I'd ask you to throw the ball around, but you don't really seem like you're like the sporty type. Well, I, I play sports. <laughs> I'm fine just watching you from a distance, but I, what's that supposed to mean? Uh, never mind. Hmm. I can't talk to you again? Okay, fine. I guess you're a bit of an ass. I play sports. I play sports all the time. <laughs> uh, what an assumption to make to somebody. You just barely know. It's locked open to... Okay, so it's, it's almost 9... Is it me, or does this thing does it look like it's gonna explode? It looks like it's gonna explode. Again. Nothing in there. Is this dangerous? Should I do something about this? I'm not entirely sure. All right, so this guy over here has a museum. Let's go rummage in his trash first. See if I can find some of his bills and stuff. All right, so now we have, uh, I, can, I can donate something um, to the museum. So I have the, Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate to the museum. And what's this thing? Gunther can tell you more about this. Okay, I'm going to donate this thingy. There you go. And this thingy. Bam. All right. So I'm not quite sure what that does. What does this do? There's a book missing here. Well, it's great. So why doesn't Gunther tell me about what the hell? Uh, maybe I have to go over here. So what is this? Earth crystal. A res... Uh, Resonance substance found near the surface. All right. Quartz clear. Yeah, I know what that, that is. That's fine. What is this? Elamite. Instinctive fluorescence makes it a favorite among rock collectors. Okay. All right. So I got three rocks, I think. <laughs> I think they're worth something. Oh, help. That was a bit too close, lady. But she's new, so let me go talk to her. We don't have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Jazz a proper education. Penny. Okay, zero out of eight love. Aw, no love for me? That sucks. But I did get, I think, get, oh no, hmm. It didn't go up. 
<laughs> I guess I must have already met her. Oh, this is new. This guy's new. I want to look for bugs, but mom gets mad when I'm all dirty. Oh, you do look like a crazy kid. Uh, it's a tough trick. Whoa, he has eight? That lady only had eight. They had ten. He, this guy just gets a ten love, and this other lady went had eight. So it's kind of weird that there's different types of... Different levels of love. Let's talk about this old guy here. Ah, uh, there's nothing like a strong cup of tea in the morning. Ah, yeah, that's completely true. So did I get, I didn't get any, any more numbers there. Maybe you're new. Hello? Hmm. Well, that was weird. Did I get that? Yeah, 19! Ah. <laughs> I guess I have to meet everybody in the village, right? Yeah, I do have a little bit of money, so maybe, maybe we can do something with that. Was it, wait, I was supposed to sell this stuff, wasn't I? I was gonna, I was gonna sell the potatoes I have. I have, I have two potatoes. They might be worth something. So let's see if we can get across to the what the uh, the Straw Drop Saloon. What do you sell? It's locked. Open twelve to twelve a.m. Hmm. All right, maybe I should come here later and see if I can get something to drink. What the hell was that? A cookie? I found a cookie. In the, the trash. <laughs> Obviously, I can, I can eat it. It's a bit strange. I'm not entirely sure if I should. Cookie, 90 energy, 40 health. That's quite a lot, actually. That's a lot more than most of these beats and stuff I've got. I've been finding around the place. Heck of a lot more. But okay, let me just put this potatoes in here and the slime. Okay. Let's leave them alone. They'll eventually get done, I guess. I also have a daffodil with uh, with some kind of a... It makes a nice gift, okay? But it has a little star on the side. That I'm not even totally sure what that's supposed to do. It gives you zero energy, so I'm... Meh. Anyways, let's go plant these things. So they need to be close to a water source. So I'm guessing this just plant them here. I can I can barely see. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. What, am, what am I stuck on? Oh, it's a tree. Can let me just chop on the tree. No, ma, 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 ma. And then, can you drop? What the hell was that? A bit weird. <laughs> it made a weird noise. All right, so I got um, a little bit of space here. See if we can't put these four seeds in here. Uh, one there, one there, one there, and one there. Give it some water. You a little bit of water, you a little bit of water, you a little bit of water, and you a little bit of water. Why is the ground different over here? Did I give you water? I did. It looks grayish. Is that good or bad? <laughs> I don't know. Did I give you water? Yes, I did. No. So I'm, ah, come on, just... Even though I can see where I'm aiming, I still miss sometimes. Now, I would like to get the, the mart open so I can actually buy some stuff. I guess that's, that's not an option today. I do have 36 copper ore. So I know... Oh, 170, 79 wood. Hmm. I need more wood. I need 300 wood so that I can... Um, I can fix the bridge. If I can fix the bridge... Oh. <laughs> that was actually painful. <laughs> if I can fix the bridge, then I can, I can get across, and then supposedly that's some kind of a, a very good site to harvest stuff, I think. I'm not sure. Maybe I should chop down a couple more trees. I also noticed that when, you're, when I'm fighting with my little rusty sword, I don't do much damage. Because it's, yeah, it only does 2 to 5 damage. So it's not much. But if you if you if you're constantly swiping and using your your sword and stuff, you leave yourself open to attack. You have to just be careful with the, how you uh, you strike stuff and attack these these little jelly monsters, <laughs> these slimes. And there goes another tree. Energy is nice and low. It's a good day's work there. Got a pine cone. All right.
right. Well, that's great. Got a little bit more wood. Oh, look at that. 91 wood. And some maple seeds. Let's put this wood here with the rest of them. Bam. Bam. Some sap. What am I supposed to do with sap? A fluid obtained negative two energy. If I eat that... <laughs> don't eat the sap. <laughs> That's what it's trying to tell you. Uh, do I have anything else to sell? I do have a lot of stuff. I can sell something, right? No, I don't think so. I don't want to sell the copper. I want to keep the copper for when I'm... Um, when I'm going to go in... in, in Wait, what is this? Oh, hello. Oh, the doggy likes me. Why is he doing in my house? So I, I got a dog named Sit. So he sits a lot. I, I couldn't come up with a better name. But he's a doggy bowl over here. I'm kind of wondering why he doesn't just hang out over here instead. Why is he in my house? Does he sleep in my house? Does he sleep with me? It's kind of... Oh, okay, he's, he's sleeping now. <laughs> Let's go to sleep as well then. All right, we got some money from the potatoes and from the slimes. Okay, good stuff. Always good having a lot of a bit more money. Now. Oh, we got some more mail. What do we have this time? Uh, missing. I lost my favorite axe. If you find it, please return ASAP. I'm having a tough time without it. There's a 250G in it for you. Whoever finds the thing. Okay. Hmm. All right, well. If I find an axe, I'll return it. Yeah, I will. I will. No worries. Okay. Um, I can only carry two, four, six. Oh, there's some... Okay, there's... there's there, okay, it can go next page and stuff. And I was really wondering what happened to my other... Other uh, things. Oh, we got my potatoes already. Oh, potatoes for days. That is, potatoes are good. Potatoes are good. Okay. Because they give you some extra potatoes. I, I noticed that from the first time I got the potatoes. No, don't you dare chop everything. Where's my dog? I hear my dog sh uh, barking, but I don't see him. Oh, look at that. We got 20 potatoes and we got... Um, hmm. Uh, this potato has a little star with it. Does it mean anything? <laughs> so many questions. All right, so the rice is also growing nicely. I think it's rice. Give it some water. Look at that. Alright, so I can I plant these again? Is that something I can do? No, I can't I can't eat it. No, 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 no. We're not gonna eat the potato. We're gonna put the potatoes in here. And we're gonna sell them. I'm not quite sure why that has a star though. You know what? I'm just gonna put these in here. And I'm gonna go and see what this means for me because <laughs> i'm curious this is a very special type of potato i guess uh wildly cultivated cultivated potato blah, 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 blah. all right let's see if we can't sell this potato i'm kind of curious so over here at pierre's mart we got i need amethyst to power my latest invention it's only it's the only thing that will work maru 300 g on a delivery i don't have amethyst it's locked open okay so it's almost it's almost time to open up so it's not nobody else wakes up this early again apparently so it's time to run through some trash cans i guess what the hell's that oh it's a field snack <laughs> okay i'm not sure if it's good like it's a good idea to to um to eat things that came out of the trash right oh, what's this thing a muscle. Okay. Apparently you can forage for stuff here as well. Can I... Can I I'm holding it above my head for some reason. Because <laughs> it's selected. Okay. Let's see if we can sell this guy. This thing to this guy. It's locked. Okay. Talk to you then. Can I give you a gift? Thanks. Wait, what did I do? Did I give you a gift? Oh, and, and I just, Mumble, mumble. Uh, I would tell you about my thoughts, but it's Fishman's secret. Well, fine, keep your secrets. <laughs> ah. So there's nothing else. Oh, there's some worms right here. I know that. 
I know that. That means there's a... Oh, you found the last book. The library has been expanded. What does this book do? What library? Whose library? <laughs> is it my library? Let's pick that up. Pick, let's pick that up as well. Why did I just do a... How do I undo this hole? Hmm. I don't have enough wood yet. Almost. Almost. I almost have enough wood. First. So it's locked. Okay. So there's somebody's shack over there. Let's first go and check out if we can't... Uh, sell our potatoes, our little magical potatoes. Whose house is that? Ah, okay, here we go. We got Quickie Mart should be open. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Hello, welcome to Pierre's. I carry only the finest goods. I have something really nice. Oh, it's a 200 coin potato? Is that good? <laughs> That's a, a mighty good potato, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of money there. I need to buy some seeds. Now, I was thinking, we have potato seeds. Well, we, I can buy potato seeds. I'm thinking about buying some cauliflower seeds as well. It says 80 coins, so it must be that you can also sell it for 80 coins? Yeah, it sells uh, to produce a large cauliflower. Okay, well, it takes 12 days though. Meh, I'm not sure entirely if that's a good idea. Parsnips and potatoes. Um, what, what should we do? I'm kind of curious. I don't have 2,000 coin yet. I'm gonna go and buy some more potatoes. So... 10... 10... 10... 10... 10... 10... 20, 20 potatoes. Yes. And I'm kind of curious about the cauliflower. So I'm gonna buy some of this as well. So 10 cauliflower. Is that good? <laughs> and I can buy some parsnip seeds. Um, yeah, what the hell not. So I have that. All right, nice. Let's go back to the farm and see if we can't plant all this stuff. Now the trouble with all these, the bigger I, the farm becomes, the more time I spend um, watering it. It's not very efficient. It's not the best way to go about it. I think I need some kind of a ooh, playground. <laughs> I think I went the wrong way here. Can't really do any playgrounds. Ah, play in the, those toys. Way too big for that. Might break something. Remind you, I didn't say old. I just said too big. Uh, the days when you were small enough to crawl on those things and just have your way at them. Uh, okay, so let's, let's see if we can't improve... Okay, so they, they go away after a while? Is that what it... that's what it means? No, they don't. Alright, well, let's plant some of these potatoes. Bam, bam. Oh, look at that. Hmm, I didn't get enough potato seeds to plant all, this, all these three plots, but okay. I also have some cauliflower seeds, 10 of those. Um, so let's go put those over here. One, two, three, two, three, two, three. Ten. Nice. And then I have some parsnip seeds. Uh, I'm, I'm going to put the parsnip seeds somewhere over here instead. Now, can I make a sign? Is that something I can do? Let's see, can we... Let's put these things. Oh, okay. Beautiful. We got the old planet. Hey, doggy. Yeah. Good dog. <laughs> um, we got a leak, I guess. I'm not sure. Let's, let's get rid of these, these clams. Is the dog trying to keep my, uh, my, my, my uh, farm safe? Is that what his job is? He doesn't seem to be running after anything. So in Minecraft, when you get a lot of potatoes, you get some, once in a while, you get a poisonous potato. That's something we can get, we can expect in this game as well. Oh, no more water. I need water. So as your field or your, your farm grows, the, you will need um, a well. But right now, at the moment, I don't think I need one yet. I'm not entirely sure if you should actually invest in those kind of things yet. Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. 
Oh, look at that. So I got quite a lot of potatoes. I'm still waiting for them to be... Wait, didn't I put them in the... I put them in here, didn't I? There's clams. Okay, well, let's... <laughs> let's see. Let's, I need to chop down some more trees. I need a little bit more wood. See, I'm, I need 30 more wood and then I have enough to go across the river. Give me a 30. Give me 30. 30, 30 wood. Good. All right, that was good. All right, not enough. Next tree. Now, for those of you guys who are kind of like contemplating that, thinking that this is really bad for the environment, I can plant those trees again if I want to. Maybe I will later on in the game. Because um, I think that's probably a good idea. Because you, you need trees for wood. Anything in these stones? Yeah, probably not. We should go back to mining sometime again. Come on, just hit that thing. Thank you. Alright. Oh, my inventory is full. Empty up my inventory. Getting kind of a little bit annoyed by the dog. All right, there we go. We got 300 wood. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna make my way down towards the uh, uh, the beach and then see if we can rebuild that bridge. I am curious as to what that <laughs> what happens if we do. Oh, ships! Ew, it smells. Yeah, obviously, it's a sewer. What's this guy doing? Why is it locked? I want to explore the sewers. Um, I don't think you should. I think Gunther has the key. Hmm. Professor Gunther, the man who runs the museum? Why do you think he has it? I saw a big rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has to have... Has to be a match for a big rusty key. Who wants to go in the sewer? Do you know what's in the sewer? Oh, hello. Oh, I <laughs> Yeah, you better run. There's something moving around in there. Yeah, it's called shit. <laughs> uh, let me just poke my rusty sword in there. Don't see anything. Okay, so there is something in there. But, uh, okay, so we have to get, we have to convince Gunter to give that to us. Uh, that, that key. So that we can, uh, we can explore the sewer. That, that way isn't under the sewer. Let's, I want to go to the beach. So let's go up this way and across. These are cute cows, by the way. Let's go across this way. And then, then, let's rummage in this trash. Oh, I got an acorn. Is that worth keeping? <laughs> um, oh, this way is down to this, to the beach. I only have 23 coins, I'm as poor as can be. On the beach, on the beach. All right, there we go. Let's see if we can't fix this. Yes, I have 300 pieces of wood. Wait, I had to fix it myself? Well, there goes all my energy. So what do we have here? What what is this? Okay, I can pick that up. Coral. Well, I'm not even entirely sure if you're allowed to pick up coral. <laughs> kind of against the law. Coral is a living creature that takes a heck of a long time to actually grow. Hmm. All right, that was it? Was that it? What, what the hell? This is not worth 300 pieces of wood. And maybe I should come here fishing sometime. I should spend some of my hard-earned money on improving some of my tools. Let's see if we can sell this coral. A colony, a colony of tiny creatures that clamp uh, together to form a beautiful structure. Yes, that is quite a beautiful structure. 
It's locked. Open nine to five. Ah, it's already six. Oh, bloody hell. Why can't I talk? To Can I talk to you? Yeah. All right. Well, let's go back to the home, the homestead. Wait, can I chop this? No, I can't. Hmm. What? Can I do this? Nope. <laughs> this is a useless beach. I want to be able to chop stuff on the beach. I mean, this, there should be some driftwood, right? This guy's got funky hair. The clouds look great this time of year, don't they? Are you like a super saiyan? You have love. <laughs> Wait, did that improve my... Uh, uh, no, it didn't. Fine. I don't need you. Alright, so we have to deal with the rats sometimes. So I'm gonna have to go to the uh, to the rat infested house. Uh, the town uh, town center. And deal with that. Perhaps that will um, will improve my, uh, my chances. I need to get... It's a lot of grinding this game. Because it, it tells you to get to level 11 for instance, but that takes a long time. Also... Oh, let's, let's put this coral in here first. So you go in there, okay. And the rest of you can go in here. Uh, bam, 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 bam. Okay, we got lots of food. Oh, I like that. Good stuff. And now let's go. Oh, hello, doggy. Sleep time. Yes, sleep tonight. Level two farming, plus one water camp proficiency, plus one. <laughs> I'm pretty good at hoeing. Uh, new crafting stone fence, mayonnaise machine, and a sprinkler. Oh, a sprinkler. I can get a sprinkler. A level two foraging. Uh, plus one axe proficiency. Okay. S uh, survival burger. How do I cook? All right. Those shells were worth a lot. Your progress has been saved. Thank you. So I got like a ton of money again. So I got um. So what, what's this? weather tomorrow is going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the egg festival. The event will take place in Pelican Town. Something between what the an egg festival? All right. What's all the fortune teller say? Uh, ba -bum, spirits of someone annoyed today. Luck will not be on your side. Oh, bloody hell! <laughs> so that's a no towards luck. Oh, see that that. It is. It has removed one of my fields. So I'm assuming that the fields disappear over time if you don't use them. Good. I was worried that they were going to be permanent. <laughs> I'm out of water. All right. Well, let's grab some water. Yeah, I'll be with you in a second. I just need to water my, my thingies, and then I can deal with you, okay? Give you last nice little water. There we go. Nope, it's the wrong spot. Yeah, good stuff. Nice little turnips. And whatever this is. <laughs> Hello, doggy. Alright, my plan's been watered. Let's go check out the mail. Dear Melinda, tomorrow we'll be holding the egg festival in town. You should arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you'd like to attend. You wouldn't want to miss the annual egg hunt? What? I got another mail. Dear from I'd like to apologize for joking about your grandpa's old cottage when you first met. It's a really nice house. <laughs> However, you might need some more space someday. That's where I can help. If you bring me some raw materials and pay a fee... Oh, bloody hell, why do I have to pay for it? I can expand your house. Okay. The first expansion I offer is a kitchen. Ooh. With a kitchen, you'll be able to cook any recipe you've learned. Anyway, I hope you're starting to feel at home. That's a, that's why I can't cook for shit, because I don't have a kitchen. Look, I don't have a kitchen. <laughs> I have a bed. I have a table. I have a uh, fireplace and a TV. I don't even have a toilet. Where have I been going to the toilet? <laughs> okay, well that's great. Without, let's first, let's go to the community center and check out the rat problem. So the community center is over there. 
So we need to go over this direction, I think. Are we there yet? No, we got straight, straight on, straight on. And then somewhere up, up that way, I think. Yeah, we have to go up. Just not entirely sure if it's over here. Yes, that's giving me the center. There you go. This map sometimes isn't very accurate. So let's put this on. Yeah, let's put that on, on active. What do we have over here? What's this? Can I pick this up? What the hell was that? Rusty dull sword. Dang, I can't do it there. Hmm. Some of my hobos be living here. I have to deal with the rat problems. Bulletin board. What are we? This is okay. Nice little kitchen here. Great stuff. And it's a big, big safe. That was a big safe. <laughs> that was taken apart a long time ago. So how, how, what am I supposed to do here with this? I can imagine that that's something that I need to investigate later on. Can I knock this open? Nope. What? Okay. Well, that's nice. Uh, can I take this with me? <laughs> Some kind of a sign thing on the floor here. Hmm. All right. So what? Yeah. Where is the? What happened to the the rat problem thingy? <laughs> I can't seem to do anything with this stuff. Can I get rid of you guys? Nope. Alright, this is this is racking my brain. So there's supposed to be something I can do. But I guess I can do something with this. Can I chop it? No, I can't. Uh, can I can I do this? Nope. So uh, how am I supposed to translate this? I will leave it. <laughs> that was a waste of time. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with that? Alright, so that's it's six o'clock. Mm. I want these daffodils. I still have to find this um, person's axe. Must have lost it somewhere, right? Got one of those uh, nice little uh, edible thingies over here. I think it's some. Just pick it up. And that one as well. It's a leak. So where could this Robin's where could, where could Robin's axe be? Hmm. Let's see. Do we have any hint? Robin lost her favorite the last time she remembered using it. If she was cutting wood south of Marnie's ranch. So. That is Marnie's Ranch, so south from Marnie's Ranch, so somewhere over there. So we have to go all <laughs> over there. Uh, so not in the mind today. If we can find her axe, that would be nice. Maybe then she'll love me. <laughs> I doubt it very much. So we have to go down to the to the um, to Marnie's Ranch. I think the fastest way to do that is through that up as well through my farm but I have to make sure that I have some inventory space otherwise um, I can't pick it up that will be kind of useless let's deposit the stuff that we just found in here doot, doot, doot. good and let's go down to Marnie's branch maybe maybe we can find it and that that scarecrow is way too lifelike uh, I think scares the bejeebus out of me I'm not even a, I'm not even a bird. All right, so somewhere south of Marnie's ranch, that's where she was chopping some wood. Hmm. 
horseradish good stuff all right that's that's the weird lady that wants to do stuff with me <laughs> see if we can't find it oh, somewhere over here nothing here maybe we cross here pick that up as well So what does her axe look like? Ooh, more of those guys. Yay! I'll take those. Those are good eating. I wonder if he's planting those. There's a sewer pipe. Ah, uh, that's gonna be disgusting. Why would you want to eat that from a? S <laughs> oh, there we go. We found it. You found the lost axe. Better return to Robin. All right. Well, where the hell is Robin? See, it's already 310, so see Robin's house is that's a carver shop. Robin. Okay, that that's where we have to go. So we are there. <laughs> we have to go there. Oh, there's so much walking in this game. La, 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 la. Okay, now we have to go up this way. That's not Robin's house, that's somebody else's house. If we go through town, we should be able to go up. And then through the town, just, do we already rummage the, the trash cans? Yes, we did. Okay, and let's go up this way because we have to get from here and we have to go there. So that means we have to go up past the community center. Oh, we got some more people to talk to. Hello. George spends the whole day in front of that darn TV set. Well, good for him. Ah, oh, spring, the season of pastels. I actually prefer Jules tones myself. Oh, excuse me. I was bumbling about fashioning, wasn't I? Okay, that's good. Just do your thing. Hey, stop that. Yuck. <laughs> okay, that's what happens when you do that in front of people. So, don't uh, open the trash cans uh, when people are around. And that's the best I learned from that. And that's the, that's the uh, community center. Hey, well, um, oh, that's, hey, you found my axe. What a relief. I almost chopped my toe off with the other, with the other one I was using. Thank you. So, well, what do I get? So I got 250 coin. Nice. All right. Um, good stuff, I guess. Oh, is it? Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. <laughs> okay, I won't open any trash cans around her then. So what do you have to say? Hey, sorry if I seem cranky. I'm a little sore from work yesterday. Who are you? I had to sort patient records for four hours straight. Okay. Well, that's useful information thanks for telling you that so who are you don't tell her i said that okay so you're you're afraid that she will get mad at you but did i get some more yes ah i need i need seven more people seven more people to talk to and then i can get that reward as well why can't i go in here i want to get those mushrooms hmm. best mushrooms are not on the table so i got a little bit more energy left and I don't really need to chop any wood. So can I can I go in here and kill some more slimes? I only have two spaces. Spicy root found in spring. I can eat that. See if we can't find... Oh yeah, this is what I don't like. The entranceway is, is locked again. Got a geode. That's good. Come on, hit that one. Yes, thank you. Oh, there's the entryway. And that goes deeper into the mine. And then here we have these guys. They don't seem to be very tough. But... I can't get to you. Well, that's kind of too bad. Ah, you made me sick. <laughs> Why am I looking green? Are you poisoning me? Bad slime. Bad slime. So this has got this pink stuff. Kind of like, uh, I don't know, some kind of uh, bug goo or something. Bug guts. Ooh, ah, we got this stuff. Okay, this is, this is copper. I need this. 
Uh, but I, uh, must just eat some of this stuff. Yes, eat spring onions. And this one as well. Got some health from that. Can I eat them all? Alright, two more. Doesn't need to give, do much for my energy though. Yes. Alright, nice. So there we go. We can get some more copper here. Ah, nice. And then... Oh, there's a lot of bugs here. Can I can I kill you through this angle? Why, why can't I do that? I can see you actually getting chopped. But you got nothing. The more copper. So okay, let's just let's just get out of here. Too many of you guys around. Too many. Bit of a crowd. Ow! He hit me! <laughs> Ooh, hey, that's a creepy guy. Stay out of that guy's range. So when he looks like he's thinking, he's gonna he's actually gonna charge. Pretty easy to dodge. I should be able to kill 10 slimes, no problem. Ah, oh, you hurt me. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was disgusting. Okay, he dropped some red ball. Some little red thingy. So can we can we throw that away? So can I can I dump that? Let's put that in the trash. A cherry bomb generates a small explosion. Stand back. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna keep that. <laughs> I'm kind of curious as to what that does. Alright, so somewhere on these, all these rocks, there is another drop down. Some kind of a, uh, a passage downstairs. So now I have to go through all these stones to find the, the spot for it? Oh, bloody hell. It's already quite late. So what happens if it's past midnight? There it is. Okay, well I got some geode out of that. There's some slimes there, but I don't need that. Let's get out. Let's get out of the mine and see if we can get to bed. <laughs> yeah, leave the mine. Thank you. All right. So it doesn't bring me to the top to the level be above me. Ooh, very dark here. Any slimes in this kind of uh, bit of night? <laughs> Things seem to be moving though. Get me home. Fast, fast, fast. It's almost midnight. I'm entirely not sure what happens when it gets when it hits midnight. I really don't want to spend money getting out of the hospital like last time. Wait, so I first let's just first put this these these wild radishes in here as well. You, you, and you. And, uh, should we put the cherry bomb there? Oh, no, this is fine. Let's leave the cherry bomb for now. Go take a little nap. Yes, sleep for the night. Just before 12. Farming, zero. Foraging, 149. And, oh, that's, that's from those, uh, those magical, uh, beats. <laughs> All right. Day 13 of spring, year one. Good. All right, well, that's great. We got some more money. Now, I'm kind of wondering... Ooh, got another letter. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. Mr. Resmodius Wizard. Oh. Hey, how are you doing today? Uh, sweetie? Sweetie? I miss you so much. Since you left, I hope the farming life is everything you hope for. Love, mom. Okay, well, mom, that makes sense. Peace, I send you your favorite cookies. Yay, cookies. Cookies, good. Put the stuff in here. Cherry bomb, cookie as well. Got some nice cookies. I like cookies. Cookies are... They make you, they make you feel good. 
Making cookies makes you feel good. Eating cookies makes you feel good. There's nothing really bad about cookies. Brackers on the other hand. Yeah, that's a different story. Oh, no more water. I'm not entirely sure if you can be happy with crackers. Crackers are the evil cookies. Does this actually ever grow? It, it looks like it's gonna be a cauliflower, but I'm not entirely sure. Let's just pee on this and pee on that one and this one as well. Look at that. We're doing it! <laughs> I have a lot of money. Maybe I should use that to improve my tools. Okay. All the rice has been uh, watered. Good. I, I want to go to the... Let's grab my copper. I think it's probably a good idea to go down to the... Um... Oh, wait. I can, I can make a furnace, right? Crafting and the campfire. Where's the furnace thing? That's a mayonnaise machine. Turns eggs to mayonnaise. I don't have any eggs. Wild seeds and a sort of wild spring seeds. Ingredients, wild horse horseradish, daffodil, leek, and dandelion. I don't, I haven't seen any dandelions. Okay, I can make a cherry bomb by putting copper ore and coal together. All right. Wait, where's the furnace? Where, what happened to the furnace? Oh, there, I need 25 stone. All right, 25 stone. I have stone. Got loads of stone. So if I make the furnace now, what does that do? Turns ore and coal into metal bars. Oh, I got, yes, my journal. Smelting, meet the wizard. Use your furnace to melt copper bars. Okay, meet the wizard, enter the wizard's tower. Can I not do that right now? <laughs> Let's go to nine. Let's see if I can, can I put this inside the house? Should I put it inside the house? I'm not entirely sure if this is a good idea. Let's put it outside. I don't want to burn the house down. So I need to put, let's grab some coal, I guess, right? Uh, how do I turn this on? Oh, hello. <laughs> that was uh, explosive. Okay, so is it going to do that the whole time? This is all new to me, so I have absolutely no idea. It doesn't look like it's safe. Should I stand up? <laughs> let's not stand over here. <laughs> let's keep that out of the Oh, hello. I got a copper bar. All right, let's put that in there again. All right, that's quite nice, I guess. What do I do with that? A bar of pure copper. Cool. All right, well, that's it for this episode. Oh, the egg festival has begun. I will, I'll do the egg festival, festival in the next episode. Anyways, that's it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. If you didn't leave a like, it's fine. I will see you guys in the next one. Little butterfly. And have a nice evening. Bye-bye.